I am alive and it's great to be alive and today I hope you're all doing well. I'm gonna be checking out a sweet Quartac build that I made. So, this is a really, really fun Quartac build I've been having a ton of fun with and you don't need a ribbon so that's great. I've got Point Strike, Serration, Split Chamber, Shred, Malignant Force, Vital Sense, Hammer Shot, and Hunter Munitions. This weapon is surprisingly effective with the Hunter Munitions mod because if you look at this gun you'll notice it's got full barrels so it shoots more bullets so you add multi shot to even more bullets and you get a lot of extra bullets that each have a crit chance of 47% but enough of the build let's get down to performance I actually really enjoy the performance of this weapon oh what have I got here it's already got a bombard at level 100 well shoot we'll just start with that I'm not sure why, uh, oh, that's interesting. The simulacrum must keep your settings from the last time you were here. Oh, that's awesome. All right. Well, you guys probably won't be disappointed with this build, so check this out. I'm going to start laying into them here. Now, it doesn't deal a lot of damage at first, but once you get those stacks to proc, look at that. I can stop shooting now for several seconds. Look at all the thousand damage slash procs. That is insane. I also have toxin damage on this, which is great as well. Complements this build because this is a slash focused uh, proccing build. And on top of that, toxin damage does the same thing. It does direct ticking damage to health. So if you focus headshots also, you can do even more damage. Look at all those procs. Oh, it's beautiful. It's absolutely gorgeous. Now, that is like the highest level enemy you'll see from the get-go in a last sortie mission. So testing it against level 100 enemies is a pretty good method. Let's do an elite lancer here though, because not everything is going to have as much armor as a level 100 bombard. So let's just say you're fighting a regular level 100 elite lancer. Let's see what this build can do against that. Boy, the rate of fire on this thing is really freaking weird. There we go. Super effective, though. Guys, I'm so sorry if my aim is trash. I literally just got home from work. I spent all night last night leveling this thing up a couple times with formas, uh, and then I didn't actually get to make the video, so I was looking forward to coming home today so I can make this video for you guys. But look at that. You get several hits in and boom, they die. No problem. Actually, let's see how many shots I can fire to uh, successfully kill the target and then like just stop shooting and let the procs kill him. So let's spawn another level 100 here. And we'll see if I can... How many shots do you think? One, two, three. Oh, wow. So technically, I could just shoot him three times and he'll die from all the procs. So this weapon is great. It is extremely accurate. As you can see, I just shot there. And look at the spread of the bullets. That does not spread out much at all. Let's get even more distance here. Let's shoot at this pillar right there. Boom! Let's get closer. That's really not a bad spread for how far I'm shooting this thing. I'm surprised a four-barreled gun can even shoot that accurately. But it's really cool because I was afraid the four bullets would travel sort of in the shape of the barrel so they'd be hitting like a little dotted square but actually all of the bullets focus in on your singular point that you're aiming at which is really cool all right so not a terribly hard build to get either but let's go ahead and spawn just 20 enemies all at once just so we can try to shred through these guys and see what this thing's capable of now, as you can see here, my rate of fire isn't the best, but it does have shred on it. So, if you can get enemies to line up with each other, you can do some extra damage there. But yeah, I have a lot of fun with this weapon. Especially if you're not fighting level 100 enemies. If you're just doing like 60 to 80 or something, this will absolutely decimate anything you're up against. A really fun weapon. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. And when you get the kill with the uh, shot, you should get obliterated. It seems to have a ton of knockback as well staggers opponents a lot which i really enjoy and it's just beautiful and really fun to see all those crits and billions of proc numbers popping up it's just like freaking adhd math just blah, 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 and it just kills them to death i love it i'm killing people with math what could be more fun it's every teacher's dream if you're a teacher you know what this is the gun for you you'll love it hup, hup, ha, hup, ha. Ugh, my parkour skills are so good my aim is to be desired though oh so let's try it at range now and see what we can do oh yeah look at that I can just stop shooting him and he'll die no problem mate no bloody problem look at that health just oh he's just bleeding to death oh oh ah oh, he's gonna live but not for long there we go 
So obviously, if you get headshots, the procs are much more effective and damaging, and you will kill them a lot faster. Oh, wow. Oh, that guy got completely destroyed. Oh, this is just a really fun gun. I love this build. Oh, that is so cool. Still effective, as you can see here, at pretty long ranges. I mean, unless you're in the plains, there's going to be very few tile sets where you have to shoot anyone from that far away. And it's just overall a decent weapon in every situation. For those of you who are curious, you can get this weapon from Ghoul Purge Bounties. That's a drop reward. Or... You can buy it in the marketplace, which I hold nothing against. That's actually what I did personally. And I really, really enjoy this weapon. The secondary is a great weapon as well. I'll probably do a review on that coming up here pretty soon. But yeah, I did have to polarize this two times to get this build. So if you want exactly what I have, look at that. My serration is not max. You could even make it a little bit stronger. Either way, I hope you guys think this is a cool build. Uh, drop your Quartec builds down below and how effective they are. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope you're all having a great day today, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, everybody.